Hey guys, so it is currently April 2nd. Obviously college decisions are all out and I'm editing my video and I realized I never filmed an intro, so here it is. It's definitely a roller coaster. <laughs> a lot of um, disappointments, but also pleasant surprises. And we're just gonna start off with my first video, which is U of M. Okay, you guys, my friend literally just texting me saying that my application that U of M, my state school that their application <laughs> that the, the, the application status has been updated okay, editing Naomi here um, so Loki, I was just very flustered like I kept on stumbling over my words because first of all, it was October 28th like I had literally just submitted my application like <laughs> not even a week ago and I, yeah it was very very early in the process i still had like 12 more applications to go so i felt like this is gonna like make or break like how this college decision season went so yeah i was just very nervous but um yeah so please forgive my stuttering okay back with the video ah okay we're gonna see <laughs> okay it's my state school so i'm like okay I have, i'm gonna get in but it's also like will i get in Ooh. Update available. Okay, the update. <laughs> hey, <laughs> so, um, I wasn't admitted to the honors college like back in October. This news didn't come until March. But yeah, that's this is the only evidence of like my decision I could get because they deleted the first one that they sent me. But I'm super grateful to have been admitted to their honors program. Okay, I got it. <laughs> Bro, we're going to college. I look kind of crusty because I was like at my community center studying. And then don't mind the like noise in the background, it's my air fryer. But um, I got um, <laughs> I got a package from Loyola saying congratulations. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna open this up, but I'm assuming it's um, an acceptance letter. Also, I got accepted into University of Iowa. But I wasn't able to record my reaction because, like, they literally just sent it in an email saying, Oh, congratulations on being a Hawkeye. Yeah, see, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh? Oh? Okay, so I got into Loyola and, yeah, I applied as an applied mathematics, whatever, and they're awarding me a presidential scholarship, 30000 a year, so 120000 over the next four years. That's pretty cool. How much is their tuition? $40,000, $47,000 a year. So you'd only end up paying $12,000 a year. Not bad. This is my third acceptance as of November 28th. Here's what they gave me, this little pamphlet and some stickers. Hey guys, so it is, um. December 15th. I did not ED by the way. I did not ED anywhere. But I was just looking at my email randomly and I got accepted into Fordham University, which is really nice. Okay, um, I also got into Stony Brook as well. I don't know where that footage went, it, it just disappeared. And I believe they gave me money, maybe around 10k. But that was really nice. And I was even going to go to one of their admitted students there, but I wasn't able to. So that was a little disappointing. But yeah, I'm very grateful for that. I've applied to eight schools. So I've gone four back. And I'm still applying to at least another four. Perhaps another four. So in total 16, if I have the energy. But it's already December 15th. Like, <laughs> decisions and, um, I mean, deadlines are in two weeks. So I wanted to apply to 16, but... At this point, I've been working on my applications since August, you know? Like, my Common App wasn't even finalized until November 15th, like, so just a month ago. So, however many I can fit in, that's how many I'll do. I am going on winter break vacation on the 21st, so next week. So that's just gonna- and I'm gonna be gone for a week, so that's just gonna cut into a week of, like, essay working, and I'll probably try to grind when I come back, but it is what it is, you know? Oh my god, it came out and I did not get in. So the decision, it just came out. It was currently 5-1, it came out like 
a minute ago, but I did not get in, unfortunately. It's okay. Like, I had a feeling that I wouldn't because I watched videos of, like, people who did apply to this. And, like, these are people who got into Columbia, got into Duke, but they didn't get into this program. So I was kind of like, it'd be really good. If, it would be really great if I did get in, but I also know that. Yeah, but apparently 11,000 people applied for the scholarship. And, yeah, I don't know how many they took. I would assume... I don't know. Hey guys, so I'm currently sick with the flu, but apparently I just got an email that an update has been posted for my Northeastern application. I applied early action, right, and I got deferred, but it's only March 13th, right? And regular decisions aren't supposed to receive an update. Uh, what's it called an update until april 1st so i'm getting mine like two weeks early and that is very concerning it's not it's not one of my top choices but um yeah, i can't even talk but i'm intrigued to see if i get in because my friend got in and be fun to get in but oh shoot so this is not my password oh <laughs> wait this is funny i got wait listed I got waitlisted and they're telling me it's telling me that I have to decide if I want to be on the waitlist by April 1st um alright so like why'd you guys waitlist me do I have if I got waitlisted do I have to write oh what's it called a letter of continued interest I'm confused but, um anyways Hey, hey guys, it's March 15th, I am still a little sick, but um, UVA just came out, I look you, I forgot I applied here, I can't lie, in terms of, like, if it's like my top choice, it's a good school, I wouldn't say it's my top choice considering I forgot I applied here, oof, I'm getting chills. Uh, I'm scared because this is like my first reach after Northeastern. So I was rejected. It's okay. Rejected from UVA. <laughs> Hey guys, so I was editing the video, but Madison just came out today. It's currently March 20th, uh, March 21st. Oh, I'm nervous because I actually like this school. I literally ran for the basement. My birthdays are out here. Look at this. I'm like, ah! oh, okay. Ooh. Let's see this. Okay, admission, admission. one active. Oh, he says that he's going to look at it and then he's <laughs> going to tell me. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm not going to tell you. I'm just going to see if you can like read my poker face. I'm going to put on a poker face. Nah, I'll do it. I'll have it in poker face. See, she just. Let me just look. Wait, I've seen it, and I'm just trying to like. No, I just. Do, I really do. What did I even apply for? I don't know. Yeah. Oh, see, she just saw it. Nah, no, she didn't. No, I didn't want to see it. So I was like, so I just zoomed in. I just zoomed in on. Bro, you're I, like the, you're no, an idea. No, 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 because I saw our holistic admissions process is designed, and I was like, um, okay. did they say that I didn't get in? Wait, because all my friends got into Madison, so like, if I go there, like, we'll all be together. Ah! I think I applied for econ. Because <laughs> I was looking at it, I'm just like, wait a minute. Oh, oh, I need, I need to check, I, I need to check the group chat. 
But I didn't like say anything because I'm just like, oh. Because like I expected like confetti and stuff like that. <laughs> okay, you guys, I needed this. Okay, you guys, it's the 22nd. I was literally just talking to my friends in school. I was like, I have a feeling a decision is coming out today. I just don't know who it is because I, Loki colleges have been gatekeeping. Oh, when they're releasing decisions, except from like the Ivies, but like Loki Northwestern, I have no idea where they're coming out. But Williams College, oh, I'm sorry, I just ran from the basement, but Williams College came out right now. So I'm gonna go check. Um, so Williams College is a little interesting because no, I don't think anyone from my school has gotten in. Like I looked at our like score for our applications and I saw that 0% who applied got in. So it's like, I don't, like obviously if God wants me to consider it, like I believe I'll get in, but Luki is in the middle of nowhere in Massachusetts. So it's not really my type of school, but I applied just cause. Yeah, I got rejected. So it's okay, like, I'm a little out of breath. I was looking at the rejection letter and it said that they admitted fewer than 1 in 25 applicants, which is so crazy because that's literally less than 4%. So like, and their admission rate was 8, 8%. So I'm like, why are y'all trying to be Ivy League? <laughs> like, like, no way, bro. But, um, okay. So now I have 7 down. You guys, I'm over halfway done. That's kind of crazy, but... Okay, see you when Northwestern comes out, I think. Hey guys, so it's editing Naomi again, and I'm just gonna do a voiceover over this clip because my thoughts were a little jumbled um, back then, but like now that I've been through the entire process, I'm just gonna let you know how I was like actually feeling. So, this was about two days before Ivy Day, and if you guys didn't know, Columbia um, was my top choice, and I was just feeling anxiety because I was just like, I really want to go to the school, but even though I think that I can get in, it's more of a matter of if it's God's will for me to get in. And me and my mom and my whole family, we had been praying that I get into Columbia for probably like years or like to an Ivy League school, right? But like, I always felt like uneasy. Like, even though I prayed, like, I felt like I'm still not going to get in. Not because, again, not because I didn't feel like God couldn't do it, but because I felt like it's not in God's plan for me to do it. So that day, my mom comes to me. She's like, I'm going to stop praying that you get into Columbia, but instead that God's will be done. And at first, I was just like, um, what? <laughs> like, what do you mean? Like, bro, not now, bro. Like, not when this decision is coming out in two days. But, but Loki, as I pondered, and pondered on it, I realized, like, yeah, like, honestly, she's right. I can't be praying for my will to be done when God knows best and he knows which school is best for me. And I would rather go to school that God has decided is best for me than rather what I think is best for me. And yeah, and I was also relating it to Nicole, you know, because I know like on TikTok where her decisions were um her decisions were like trending and like, you know, her dream school was UCLA. And at this time I didn't know, but like now that I know she got rejected and I know like that must have been extremely hard for her. But she's going to school that I hope is probably a better fit for her. And she's believing in God for that. And I realized like I'm seeing all these signs that like people getting rejected from what they thought was their dream school just to end up at a school that is better for them and for me at this point i was just coming into terms with that and you'll see the next day when i find like once i had finally accepted that god showed himself up you'll see hey guys oh shoot no. northwestern just came out i thought it was coming out in an hour but oh, okay. it's coming out right now well it came out already it came out like 40 minutes playing the song. <gasps> Yeah, Northwestern is one of my like top three schools. So like, um. Ah! Decision. Is it gonna, like, ask no, I need to log in. Okay, take your phone. Take your phone. Stop. Take it. Okay. No, no, just stop. No. I said you could do it for Vanderbilt. My no. brother's trying to hide my decision. Okay. Stop. Tisha! Yeah, I want to. Tisha, I want to see it right now. Tisha, should we open it? Tisha, I want to. No. Tisha, I want to. TJ, just just show me it. Just show me it. TJ, just show me it.
Hey guys, um, it's the same day and I have recovered. Sorry if I bursted your ear brows, but Emery's now out. So <laughs> I was just not just like, even though like I wanted to get in so badly, I was not expecting that. Like, CJ, stop. Like, why are you such in a rush? This is. I want to see my application. Show me, bro. Hmm. Okay. I'm sorry, but you got in. Congratulations! You're what the hell? What? Will's got competition. Shut up! What the? Why am I what? Bro, my poker face thing works. Like what the? Like, like come on! Tell me now. I don't even. You guys, I can't. I can't even is scream, is you guys. This is. This is so. What bro, comes out? Better think. Oh my god! Thank you, Lord. Okay, bro. Like literally, this is why you should let me do all of them like this. Cause you've got in in three for three. Madison, Northwestern, Emory, all because I'm. <laughs> like, you guys, I'm going to college. Like, <laughs> okay, you guys. Um, Manimal comes in about one minute, but like, look at my boys. <laughs> I have been screaming, you guys. I was not expecting Come on, this at hurts. all. TJ, yeah, his head hurts from listening to that. <laughs> but um. No, TJ, not yet. Oh, my brother's gonna take press my computer it. again. I press it. It's, it's wait. Wait until like it says after five thirty. You're gonna have to wait a minute. I'm just so grateful for God because I know that I am not qualified to get into any of these schools, but God made me qualified. Like what? 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 I have choices. I'm just so excited. Like. I just put in your password at this point. It's out. Okay. Okay. My brother's gonna check Vanderbilt for me. Like, Loki, I'm just gonna look. Uh, I can see a t shirt. Okay. Rejected. It's okay, though, because I got into a Northwestern and Emory. You guys, this was an amazing day. And honestly, I feel like God knows, Tisha, I feel like God knows the schools that I would actually like consider and the schools that I wouldn't. Because Vanderbilt. Although, like, it's a good school. But in comparison to Northwestern, I just feel like, I don't know. It's okay. You guys. Wait, why did they put my whole middle name, though? Mm -hmm. All right, NYU just dropped. I gotta do my thing. <laughs> Stop. Yeah, sure, it's a work. It has a like 75% work rate, you know? <laughs> I should play my music. Hey. Um. Uh, uh, I'm gonna teach Let me look at my own decision, bro. Uh, uh, Please, uh, I wanna. You wanna look at it? My stomach hurts. Are you sure you wanna look at yes, this? Yes, I wanna look at it. Just okay. Remember. Three, two, one. Oh, I think I rejected. Yeah, from NYU. What? NYU. It's a good school. It's a good school. Is it? Yeah. Wait, when does Columbia come out? When is the next one? At six. Yeah. Happy Ivy Day. Oh. I think I'm gonna open up Harvard first. Hey guys, okay, this is probably the last time I'll be doing a voiceover, but I just wanted to explain like <laughs> why my face looked red. So um yeah, I was crying, like I don't know what it was, but I was like praying like probably 30 minutes before my IB decisions came in and I just started like crying because I felt like, like I just felt like at that point, God just told me like, I'm sorry, but you're not getting it. <laughs> and I'm just like, oh my gosh, like, yeah, yeah, like I'm okay now, but like back then I was just, I felt so sad, like although I knew it was for the best, like I just, like you just know, you know? And yeah, even when I was opening up my NYU, like I even said, like my stomach hurts because I was like, I also felt like, yeah, I'm not getting into that school either. So, you know, but it's okay, guys. It's okay. Like I am doing great. Rejection is redirection.
I didn't get into Columbia. No, it's okay. Hey guys, so um, um, today is my last decision. Stanford came out. And Loki came like <laughs> it came out like an hour ago, but like Loki, I don't really care. I'm just gonna open it up so we can't end this college decisions journey because Loki, I'm tired and I'm already satisfied with the choices that I have. So Northwestern and Emory, I'm so so blessed. And I'm already looking for roommates, and yeah, I got rejected from Stanford, but I'm okay. I want to say thank you guys so, 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 so much for watching this video. I don't know where I'm going to commit to yet, but right now, I, I'm just trying to like sort out Northwestern and Emory. Um, yeah, I'm going to tour both schools, see which one fits my vibe better, and... I will keep you guys updated because I'm so so excited like definitely we're gonna have some college vlogs like getting ready for college videos coming up soon I just want to say thank you god like because I genuinely do not deserve these acceptances if you know anything from this process is that you can have like the best SAT score like perfect GPA amazing extracurriculars like doing a bunch of like cancer research or whatever like banger essays, amazing letter of recs, and still not get into the best of schools. Like, so really, I believe that I got into Northwestern to Emory just based on the mercy of God. Like, there's really nothing to it. I'm nothing special, but I believe that it was God's favor working for me. I'm just gonna end the vlog here, but thank you guys so much for watching. Good luck to all my future classes who are applying may the lord be with you and i will see you in my next video